Hey, my powerful Scorpios. Welcome to Scorpio Intuition. So family, I just want to say I love you. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you for your likes and subscribes, your support. You know, we go long, long ways, long ways, long time, long time. So with that being said, let's get into this energy. See what spirit got for me. Get into this energy. Oh, before I do, family, the, the book that I just received is uh, How to Be a God. It's by... Um, a wand um melon i haven't read it yet but it was suggested to me to read so i'm gonna read it and on the back it says uh, a source of wisdom for those looking to be leaders in the world and in control of their own destiny this publication provides the reader with proven keys to be successful so with that just want y'all to know what i was reading but anyway this is clarity spirit what is for our powerful brilliant sexy uh scorpios messages of clarity and truth mm. So Scorpios, I feel like right now, Spirit says, with the four swords in reverse, Spirit says, now is the time for you to come out of resting. I feel like there was a period of you really laying low, you being in an energy of uh, healing and just restoring your energy from things that could have hurt you, pe people, places, and things. And Spirit says, now this is the time to emerge Uh with with your new healed uh enlightened self it's like the energy of now being able to come into who you truly are and what it is that you truly want i see right now there's an energy of moving slow somebody i feel like there's and also spirit saying this is someone that is finally coming out of hermit mode wanting to come in and give you some type of clarity and they have been uh they've been moving slow towards you but it's like they're moving towards you now because the world car it seems that you have put all of your situations all of your issues with them in the past you left it in the past and you're no longer like feeding them your energy or anything of that nature and i see here with the five of pentacles there's the energy of this person coming out coming back out towards you because they feel that they have been left out they feel that you are leaving them in some type of aspect um it's like the energy of you are no longer giving them your energy and it's like if you're elevating you're not including them in your elevation and this person feels like now is the time for me to come back and and come to get scorpio's attention like scorpio bro bitch i'm here <laughs> Yeah, they've been moving slow towards you because they really weren't, wasn't sure on how they were going to give to you. Somebody is trapped in their mind about how to make a move, but this is them uh, trapping themselves with their thoughts. You could be dealing with an Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra. Very much so. I see uh, air signs heavy. And also, this person, that right now, Scorpio Spirit is saying that you are coming into a balanced life. You're coming into union. Somebody you are about to meet soon or that you have already met is wanting to lock it down. They say, Scorpio, you got to be mine, baby. But at the same time, while you have new love coming in, ready to lock something down with you, you also have someone from the past that is really feeling like you're leaving them out and behind because of their lack of movement. This is somebody that um, probably done something wrong and did not want to come and apologize. So what they did was they just pulled back, hoping that you would, as they pull back, you will move forward towards them. But it's the energy of that never did happen. You never did pull back from them and I mean, or go towards them. So now since you didn't go towards them when they pull back, now you're just uh, elevating, you're moving in your own energy. And now this person is worried that maybe Scorpio will never return. So now instead of them in this back in, you know, pulling back energy, now they're like, wait, Scorpio, where are you going? <laughs> Bitch, I'm going to greatness. <laughs> Messages of clarity and truth. Yeah. Yeah, right now, because this is the energy of the Ten of Swords. This is like, this person feels like you're no longer emotionally um, tied to them. Yeah, they feel like their lies and their deceptiveness in the past has really triggered you to move on to newer and better things. And this is something that is stressing this individual out as you are embarking on a new thing. They're coming in hoping to see that they can revive an old situation because they're stuck on feeling like you are you are like really moving on without them. And right now 
their biggest fear and what is happening is that Scorpios, as you become to get into union with a particular person, um, this individual from the past is going to come in right when you are in love or you are in a union. And the, the three of swords usually was some, them fucking with somebody else when you were into them. Now, the three of swords is them being heartbroken because they slept on your love and somebody else started loving your beautiful eyes and now they feel it some type of way. <laughs> I'll take it to you. Anyway, Scorpios, that's what I got for you today. I love you. Love yourself. Remember, we are the gods and there's nothing they can do about it. And if ain't nobody told you they love you today, let me be the first to say, I love your beautiful ass. You're so lovable. And I am grateful to be in your energy. Bye, family. <laughs>